Howdy folks, another Herbie Adventure. Today we're going to try some uh, dry ice well fracking. Built this custom lid, so we're going to wall that onto the casing. Got our welder all set up. And that whole cap comes off. So I have a high pressure valve there, good to a 4500. Then I got a high pressure gauge, see what kind of PSI or dry ice is going to make. So. Anyway, we'll get this welded up and then we'll go on to stage two. All right, see you in the next video. All right, now that we got our cap welded on, you want to fill the casing with water because you cannot compress water, but you can compress air. So when you add the dry ice, we don't want to make an air compressor. We want that water to find the holes to seep into and start fracking. So if you don't fill it full of water, then all you're doing is making one big air compressor and you're not really getting the job done. So we want the water to do the work for us. Like I said, you can't compress water. So we'll get her about 10 feet from the top and we'll stop. All right, cool. See ya. All righty, I'm gonna, I'm gonna fire my welder. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Anyways. So we dropped the dry ice, and uh, yeah, we got a couple of good holes. We're losing a little pressure, so we might have to go back and fix that at a later date. So before we weren't getting any water out of the hole, but now we are. Yeah. So, anyways, we'll let it do its thing. See ya.